Hello. In this lecture, we'll learn how to use an HDRI image in Blender. We have such a 3D scene. Let's switch to render preview mode. As you can see, our scene looks dark and doesn't cast any shadows. It means, we need scene lights to get render. There are two ways to light up the scene. The first way is to add scene lights. Let's press Shift A and add a sunlight. Increase strength of the sunlight. There we go. The sunlight is illuminating the scene and casting shadow. But, everyone may not know how to use scene lights properly. Also it will take much more time. The easiest and fastest way to light up a 3D scene is using HDRI images. HDRI is a panoramic photo, which contains a large amount of data. HDRI images are used for lighting of a 3D scene. You can find and download HDRI images for free on the web. Let's remove the sunlight and add HDRI image instead of it. There are two ways to add HDRI environment texture. Firstly, let's go to World Properties menu. Drop down surface section and click on the color node. Let's select the environment texture. As you can see, our scene is looking pink color. It means, we need a HDRI image. Let's click on the open button and select a HDRI image. There we go. As you can see, the scene is illuminated according to the angle of incidence of the sun in the image. Also, it is casting long shadow. Another way to add HDRI image is using Shader Editor. Firstly, let's remove the HDRI image we have added. Let's expand Timeline window and switch to Shader Editor. Then, switch to World Mode. Press Shift A and add an environment texture. Connect the color node to other color node. Now, let's select the HDRI image. There we go. We can change the angle of the sun rays by rotating HDRI image. To do this, let's press Shift A and add a mapping vector. Then, let's add a texture coordinate. Connect the generated node to vector. Connect the vector to another vector node. Then, let's rotate the HDRI image on the Z-axis. As you can see, the direction of the shadow will change as we rotate. Also, we can rotate the image on the Y-axis. So, the length of the shadow will be shortened. Also, we can increase or decrease the power of HDRI lighting. Many times we want to render by hiding the HDRI image. Because, HDRI images usually are used for lighting of the scenes. To hide HDRI image during render, let's go to Render Properties menu and scroll down to Film section. Let's enable the Transparent option. There we go. It means, we will use lighting of the HDRI, but the image won't display and render result. What we have done so far, has been with the Cycles Render Engine. Let's switch to EV Render Engine and see what happen will. As you can see, it is faster than Cycles Render Engine. But we can get more realistic and accurate render with Cycles. As you have noticed, HDRI doesn't cast shadow in EV Render Engine. 
The simplest way to fix this problem to use artificial sunlight. Let's add a sunlight to the scene. We can increase the power of the sunlight and change the angle. As you can see, the sun is casting shadow. But when we try to rotate HDRI image, the direction of the shadow won't be changed. We need to align and link the sunlight with the sun of the HDRI image. To do this, we'll use HDRI Sun Aligner add-on. Let's remove the sun we have just added. Firstly, we need to download the add-on file. I will give you download link in the description. Then, let's go to edit menu and select preferences. Let's click on the add-ons tab, and then install button. Find the file we have just downloaded and install. Then, enable the HDRI Sun Aligner add-on. Let's press N key and open the right side menu. Click on the HDRI Sun Aligner tab. Now, let's press the Calculate Sun Position button. And then, press Preview button. There we go. The add-on has calculated the sun position and circled in red. Let's click on the new sun button. Now, we need to link HDRI Sun with the sun we have just added. To do this, Let's click on Add Rotation Driver button. Now, let's rotate the HDRI image on the Z-axis. There we go. Our artificial sun is rotating linked with HDRI sun and casting shadow. Thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial.